Hey guys, welcome to Diecast Reviews. Today I'll be doing a review on Metallic Snot Rod here, who obviously is in the Scavenger Hunt series for 2020. Um, he's the last car I have to do. Well, I was going to say he's the last car I have to do that's in the Scavenger Hunt series, but I believe the Super Chase is also in the Scavenger Hunt series, uh, the Metallic Transforming Lightning McQueen. So there will still be one more uh, scavenger hunt 2020 car that I will review the transforming light McQueen metallic super chase Yeah, we'll talk about that when I do a video on it, but um, you have a special metallic edition there I do like the snot rod card art though. I really do like it um, Snot rod and pine pot. Uh, it's kind of pine pot On the back here, we've got the uh, scavenger hunt symbol the text Special Metallic Edition, and I've done reviews on all four of these guys. Uh, 2019 Mattel, and uh, nothing nothing else on the back. So uh, let's get Snap Rod here, uh, Metallic Snap Rod here, out of the package. Here he is, out of the package. He looks very, very nice. Uh, I like Snot Rod, probably my favorite tuner. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, I think Snot Rod had uh, my favorite tuner. I like all the tuners, but I think Snot Rod has to be my favorite. Uh, so, yeah, obviously kind of got like that muscle car look with the stance. Uh, if we look here, here's his smile and there's his eyes that are always hid behind the uh, engine. So like you can't really see <laughs> kind of interesting. I'm not sure how he sees like that because they're hidden behind his big, big blown engine here. That I think it's that I think it's the same part as the base. You can kind of see like there's a hole right there. So what I think they do is like they insert a, the base and then there's a hole right there that this engine comes out of. But uh, actually, it's orange underneath there, so I'm not sure. Or maybe they molded mold metal around that after that. But uh, there you can see the engine with the red. Um, decent detail on the uh, engine. It is plastic, obviously. But uh, yeah, decent detail on the engine. You've got that little symbol that says SR, obviously for snot rod. On the side there, uh, he's got like red line tires, so that's pretty cool. Um got this black stripe it says snot rod in the back there black stripe there's his exhaust pipes that come out from the side uh, you can see they're part of the base as well probably the same obviously the same piece as that uh, there's his back wheels that are way bigger than his front wheels you can see and they're also red lined red lined tires those rims are pretty cool So it's kind of interesting to look at his front tire and back tire because and compare them. I don't know. But uh, yeah, as we go to the back here, you can see he's got the SR logo again. And he's got the snot rod license plate that uh, I don't know what it says above it. You know, way too blurry for me to read, but uh, his license plate does read a snot rod. And uh, there you can see some taillights. It's kind of hard to see on this metallic orange, but they are there. Here's the base of the car, made in Thailand, and 29A is the code, the base code. Um, yeah, so that is like the detail of Snot Rod, I guess. Uh, I really like the orange color on him, the metallic orange. Definitely looks very nice. Uh, you can kind of see a reflection in it there. You can see my phone. Yeah, I like the grill as well. So if we give, put Snot Rod here. Let's compare him to the normal snot rod. This one is also a Thailand release. Um, M43A though was the base code on this one because this one was released very early 2020 actually. I found this one in like February of 2020. Um, so M43A would make sense for that to be the base code. It was gonna be, I found it in a, well it was gonna be a vlog. Uh, I had like, I think going from February to early March, I had, like, clips of me finding stuff in stores. It was gonna be a vlog that, uh, ended up kind of getting cancelled. Um, 
but yeah, like, it was gonna be something different, because usually my vlogs are me going to, like, stores on one day, um, actually, I haven't done a vlog in, like, two years almost, but it was gonna be, like, different clips for, like, a month worth of time of me going to the store, actually, it was gonna be more like two to three months worth of time of me going to the store, and, uh, Snap Rod was one of the things I found, uh, in the, I think, Silver Jackson Storm case, it was a pretty cool find. Uh, yeah, you can definitely see the metallic orange. I think it looks lovely. Um, kind of like a darker bronze, I guess, is if that's the correct word. I don't know. I really like the way they metallicized this orange. They probably could have done it a couple different ways. I think this way works just fine. Obviously, other than that, you can kind of see all the detail is the same. The engine is the same color. See the wheels there. I do like that they metallicized the snot rod text there. Actually, the license plates are different. That's really interesting. I'm not sure why the license plate are the license plates are different. You can see this one is snap rod, as well. But uh, it's a orange text on a white plate. This one is white text on a blue plate. Hmm. I'm honestly not sure what the reason for that was. Is of one of these he appeared in the movie with one of these plates. That's for sure. I don't think he had two different plates in the movie. I would assume it's that one because it's on the uh, I don't know. Just kind of it seems to fit him more, and it's on the regular version. Yeah, really not sure what the reason for the blue plate is. The text on the top, while it's too blurry to read, looks to be the same. So, yeah, I'm really not sure what the uh, reason for the different plates are. Hmm, that's, that's really interesting. Yeah, that's really interesting. But uh, here it is, metallic snot rod. Compared to metallic brand new mater. Obviously, they're kind of the two non-piston cup racers non like i don't know union jack ramon uh metallic versions the ones that are just like the full um their full paint job is just one color and the color is metallicized um i feel like mattel should do these more well i do like the metallic paint uh miss piston cup racers i feel like metallic union jack ramon that was a kind of weird release um, you know, like, they did a Metallic Sally a few years ago, Metallic Cruise. I feel like doing these types, um, is a better idea. I don't know, just have the whole car one color and that color is metallicized. I think that would look absolutely amazing. It does look absolutely amazing. Um, uh, Metallic Flow would look really, really cool, in my opinion. Uh, Metallic Luigi and Guido, those might look pretty cool. Uh, you know, there's things that they could do, and these two are, in my opinion, really nice. I think my favorite is Metallic Brand New Mater out of the two, but uh, Snot Rod is definitely my second favorite Metallic uh, release from 2020, no doubt about that one. So yeah, let's get them right on the turntable. Maybe center him, there we go. Uh, so yeah, that should do it for my review on Metallic Snot Rod. I hope you guys all enjoyed the video. Hit that like button, subscribe, share, comment, all that good stuff. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.